Hi. I'm Ben. I'm Tara. I mean, she's Tara. You're right. And uh, we've been asked to do an update after um, being in the Stolen Childhood documentary, mm -hmm. right? So, how are you feeling? Good. Good. It's about a year and a bit late. Year and a bit later, right? What um what's happened for you since the Stolen Childhood um, documentary, Ben? Well, it's been good. Yeah. And I hope everyone who has pandas out there, well, I hope it ends soon, very fast. Yeah. Very quick, like. Very fast for everyone. Yeah. Because yeah. it's not very fun, is it? Yeah. Yeah. Um. After the Stolen Childhood crew came to um, film us, uh, we learned that a referral to a hospital in Alberta was approved. Um, and so we were able to fly out to Alberta, right? Do you remember getting on the plane? Yeah. Yeah. And uh, uh, see a specialist there who then coordinated with our local pediatrician. And Ben was able to receive four rounds of and Ben was able to receive four rounds of IVIG here in our local hospital in Ontario, right? Mm -hmm. And so that's pretty fantastic. So you did four rounds. So you did one every month. Yeah. For how many days were we in the hospital? Four days. I mean two. For two days, right? So yeah. one every month for and, two days. And and ever since I was three, I had pandas. You're and right. now I'm eight. And how do you feel? Good. Yeah? Do you think that um, your pandas is getting better? Yeah. I think so too. So remember your brain would get stuck on things? Mm -hmm. It doesn't really anymore, right? Mm -hmm. Remember you needed to touch certain things in certain ways? Mm -hmm. That doesn't happen. Remember sometimes you'd have a hard time in a flare and get really angry a lot? Yeah. Yeah. Does that happen anymore? No. Look at that, right? Yeah, how are you doing at school? Good. Really good. Good. Um, so Ben is doing so much better. OCD, tics, um, attention's improved. He's doing great at school. Yeah. And um, having just a happy, right? You're feeling happy, which is pretty great. So we noticed a big difference after the, um, probably the third round there. That's when things started to get quite a bit easier for you, right? Yeah. Um, also since the, um, crews come, I've been able to connect with some families from across, uh, Canada and I'm working with, uh, some of those, uh, wonderful people. Uh, they're all parents of kids with, uh, pandas or pans, um, to help, um, start a national organization. Mm -hmm. So we've been working really hard and, um, we are going to start an organization to support families. Um, and awareness um, around pandas, pans, and autoimmune encephalitis in Canada. So I think that's pretty fantastic. We are very aware that we are extremely lucky that Ben was able to access IVIG um, close to home in Ontario, and I'm very aware that um, there are a lot of kids, um, families, who deserve that opportunity um, and deserve to have physicians who know how to treat and um, can treat quickly and can treat and identify pandas right at the um, onset. So it's not years, like you were three, right? No. When it started and no. now you're eight. That's not, that's not great. That should never happen to people, right? Yeah. 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 Um, anyway, I'm very proud of you, Michael. And uh, ben, we are doing very well. Can you stand up? Great. So I'm very proud of you. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Do you want to say anything else? I hope everyone out there has a good day, and I hope everyone out there who has pandas um doesn't have it anymore. And they start to feel better soon, right? Yeah. Yeah. Because you feel better. That's pretty special. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Thanks very much. <laughs>